the door is open. Ah, there you are. Come in. Have a seat. I figured that you know why I called you in here. Right? Mm hmm. It's because I wanted to have a talk with you and how your training and whatnot is going. From everything that I've seen here on your records, you have outstandingly outgrown your first gradings of training, which I'm highly impressed with. You're moving higher into the ranks of your peers. Mm hmm. I'm less to say that I am a proud of you. And also, your grades in general have improved by tenfold. Mm hmm. Makes me wonder. What kind of student like you is doing around here in these regular quarters? What I mean by that is you deserve better, better training, better studies, better teammates, a better group, a better organization. Which leads me to this. I think you're ready to join my organization. If you not accept, that is up to you. But if you do accept, you'll be trained in the highest professionals I can find. And also be in the prestigious studies of my team. And of course, you'll be getting your own living quarters as well. Everyone has one. Mm hmm. And also for your hero training, instead of this regular pay output that they're doing, you get double it. Since I am a number one hero, that all. Nonsense and whatever. I'm not forcing you to join my organization, no. You are, you are at free will here. If you choose to not accept, you'll, fu you'll be staying here. But if you do accept, I'll be more than glad to put you aboard my team. That it's settled then. Welcome to my organization. Now, before things get out of hand and you go willy-nilly around my organization, I shall put down some rules before I do so. Now, there is a penalty for coming in late. Yes. You'll be doing more extensive training if you do come in late. And that means you'll be going through the day and night. I don't accept tardiness. Alongside with that training, you would have to write a hundred w word apology for being so tardy around my class. But besides the future problems that may occur, you already know the benefits because I've told you.
I'm hoping you don't let me down either. <sighs> hmm? Oh, uh, yes. I've been quite tired recently. I've been staying up very long nights. Been working, excuse my French, my ass off. <laughs> But alongside grading papers and trading myself, there's also been an influx of crime and robbery going around. Well, not this, not even this past week, there's been three robberies on a bank. They think they could do anything in this city, but not when I'm around. But, this has grown me tired, and I will be putting in some vacation days so I can get my rest back, and in short, I'm going to be putting the number two hero in charge. Mm-hmm, that's right, Hawks. Of course I'd trust Hawks. He's the number two hero. And also, I've known him for quite a little bit. Being at his young age, he is quite ignorant. But he knows what he's doing. So I trust him in that sense. Although he does drive me to a boiling point at times. He's still trustworthy. Mr. Aizawa. Well, as of right now, he's in an infirmary. He hurt his leg and arm while he was on a mission. But they will get recovered no time soon. Well, in a short time is what I meant. Sorry, I'm slipping up on my words. Yes, I am quite tired. <sighs> and after I'm done here, I'm going to be putting in my work hours. And then I'm going to be requesting my days off. Because in all honesty, you were my last meeting for today. Mm-hmm. Yes. Oh, before I let you go, and let you pack up your things, I need you to sign this paperwork so the hero organization knows that you're moving over to mine. Mm-hmm. All right. <coughs> you need to sign here, here, and initials here, and your date of birth as well. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, I'll be glad to see you around my organization more. And hopefully I can train you into eventually taking my spot as the number one hero. Of course, I always trade my heroes to the point where they could defeat me, because someday I won't be here. But there will be another, another successor to take my place. And I'm hoping it's one of you. <laughs> you know, you remind me of... Myself, when I was younger, full of joy and wanting to help people all the time. 
but nonetheless, I shall let you go now. Go pack up your things. All right. See you later. <laughs>